for the most comprehensive CLAT preparation program ends now. Baiju's exam prep brings to you over 300 recorded lectures, 300 plus hours of live classes, over 50 mocks across CLAT and non-CLAT exams and 9000 plus topic specific preparation questions. All of this specifically curated by NLU alums and IM grads. So what's stopping you? Go register for the Baiju's exam prep scholarship test now and get thousands of scholarships. Hi everyone, good evening and welcome to Baiju's exam prep. My name is Alba Sharma and this is our series on 50 most common RC topics. Today we have set number 15. We've already done 14 good topics. We've come a long, long way. Uh, have you learned a lot across these sessions? Yeah. So, uh, I hope everyone can hear and see me very, very clearly. I hope everything looks absolutely fine. I'll tell you exactly what the agenda of the session is. Please give me a second. I'm unable to see your chats. Give me, give me, give me one minute. Give me one minute. Yes. Amar, now I can see your chat. Good evening. So what do we do in these sessions? Let me take you through that very, very quickly. See, we have been doing ap approximately 14 topics on which RCs have or can come in the examination. Today is set 15. And with the series that we do, we try to understand these common topics. And we also solve one RC pertaining to the topic that we have discussed. The pattern of the passage will be exactly like CLAD gives us. 450, 400 words, word limit, kind of questions, tone of the author, main idea, vocabulary based, figure of speech based, common questions. That's what we discuss in the class. So today's topic is going to be history. A lot of you uh, don't seem to be very comfortable with the idea of history because you haven't read that a lot. Or maybe you did not enjoy reading history. But then see a historical passage can absolutely come in the examination. And the idea is to be comfortable with that in the class today. So I, I hope everyone's ready for the topic history to be discussed today. Let's quickly have a look at the agenda. We've already discussed that. We discussed popular genres, popular topics. We've discussed many in the last few weeks. Uh, 14 have already been discussed. If you haven't seen those videos, make sure you watch them. There's a playlist curated on our YouTube channel. You can find the list and follow uh, all the videos that I've taken. Uh, so, and we're going to be doing one RC today on the discuss genre, discuss topic. Today's topic being history. Before we discuss history a bit more, a couple of things for you. What we have a free workshop uh, happening for people who are targeting CLAT 2024. So if you think you uh, are targeting CLAT 2024, make sure you attend this workshop on 23rd April 6 p.m. Where sir is going to be discussing about strategies that you can follow for success. And we have launched our CLAT 24 comprehensive course. If you want to know more about the program, that's the number of our counselors. You can call them and know more about it. So that's it about our program. Okay, so before I show you the passage, let me talk uh, to you about history. Look, history pe ek passage aega, to kya a sakta usme examination mein? Let's discuss that. A passage in history can have discussion on the history of a nation, the history of a culture, or the discussion over some relevant artifact. For example, tabula rasa, aapne agar news padha tha regularly, आपको याद होगा टेब्यूला रासा एक टैबलेट था जिसका एक फ्रैगमेंट मिला था और अभी ही लेटली किसी ने उस फ्रैगमेंट का इंस्क्रिप्शन को ट्रांसलेट किया था इंग्लिश में यू रिमेंबर लास्ट वन मंथ में बहुत न्यूज में आया था इफ यू रिमेंबर दैट टैबलेट हाय निधि गुड इवनिंग सो समथिंग ऑफ दैट सॉर्ट इज वेरी लाइकली टू बी आस्ट इन द एग्जामिनेशन स्पेसिफिकली अगर वो न्यूज़पेपर में आ रहा है it has been something of relevance in the last one year. It can very easily take a place into your English section as an RC. Today, we're going to have a similar passage where we'll be discussing some old artifacts. Artifacts kya hote? Antiques. Ya aise cheeze jo historically relevant hai aur wo ek value hold karti hai. So, we'll be discussing that today. An article on something that was historically important. और उसके बारे में बहुत कुछ डिस्कस हुआ है कुछ साइट्स के बारे में डिस्कस हो सकता है यू रिमेंबर लास्ट ईयर द किलरी साइट 
How many of you remember solving that passage in 2023's class? The Kilari site excavation tells us ki uh, Indus Valley civilization pehle aaya ya Kilari site pehle aaya. You remember solving it? That was history. I have a similar passage for you today. Shall we go ahead with that? Solve kare passage everyone. Good to go? Chal, I'm going to show you the passage everyone. Uh, the passage is spread across three and a half, four pages. Read the pages and send me a done once you're done reading the page. Remember, questions may main idea question be here, tone of the author question be here, vocabulary question be here, inference question be here. Apply all the knowledge here while you read the passage. All the best everyone. Page number one, read this and send me a done. Hi Anand, first page of the passage, jaldi se padlo. Everyone who's joined me, this is the first page of the passage. Please read that very carefully. I'm highlighting a few things for your reference. We shall discuss them later on. Send me a done once you're done reading the page, everyone. Uh, I think my video buffered for a second, but now it looks fine. Page number three, everyone. Uh, Yug. Uh, see, the series that you're watching right now, this is passage 15th death that we are doing. Okay, please understand carefully. I will be doing 50 such topics that you should be reading. I've already done 14 such topics that you should be reading that mostly come in CLAT. Can mostly come in CLAT. That's the whole idea of this series. So, watch my video. Uh, saved in this playlist as a playlist in this channel there are 14 videos already saved okay watch all those 14 videos i've discussed 14 topics already that are important for clat i'll be taking some more 50 approximately back to this page everyone do that quickly
Yes, Anand, you can have a passage in MHC Law as well. And here comes our last page, everyone. Um, could you just provide us list in the official course app like I have taken subscription for your batch or some? Oh, yes, of course, Yog. Yog, all of these topics are going to be discussed in detail in your batch. Don't worry about that. We'll have detailed discussion on eclectic reading every single topic. Okay. Chali, passage done everyone. Now let's come to question number one. Let's see uh, what the main idea of the passage is. What did you read and what do you think is going to be the main idea of the passage we discussed? It was in history. But what about history? Okay. Uh, culture, history, mandapam, the Yeah, Raj, uh, for some reason, my session is buffering. Looks fine now. I'm so sorry. For some reason, it's buffering. Okay. Okay. Uh, B, see, let's check out each option. Option A says the history and journey of the Mandapam from Madurai to Philadelphia. The passage talks about these Mandapams, these pillars that are there in the Philadelphia Museum. But they don't belong to Philadelphia, right? They don't belong there. Then what is it about? Let's keep that pending. B says the cultural and religious significance of the Mandapam to the Indian community in the US. Uh, Anand. Please be very careful about something. Main idea wo hota hai, jo pure passage mein shuruat se leke end mein aapko nazar aata hai. Is the entire passage from the beginning to the end talking about how important these mandapams are to Indian community jo US mein rehti hai. Unke liye ye baut zaruri hai. So kya pura passage isle likha gaya hai? No. ये तो एक फ्रैगमेंट है बट और बहुत सारी चीजों की बात करी है इसकी भी बात करी कि मंडपम कहां से आए ये मंडपम किसने परचेस किया फिर किसको मिला ये कहानी चलती जा रही है इस पे पूरी बुक लिखी गई है मल्टीपल अदर थिंग्स आर बीइंग स्पोकन ऑफ तो बी मेन आइडिया इनकरेक्ट हो जाता है ऑप्शन सी द कंट्रोवर्सी सराउंडिंग कंट्रोवर्सी एक फ्रैगमेंट है बट अगेन क्या पूरा पैसेज सिर्फ कंट्रोवर्सी समझाने के लिए but the passage did not have a negative tone and that's why option c cannot be your answer so that also is eliminated option d says the architectural and artistic feature of the mandapam yes the mandapam having a lot of architectural and artistic features are being discussed but how did it move from madurai to going to multiple hands and then reaching philadelphia om j you have the answer the answer is going to be none other than A. Puri history, journey, kaha se start wa madurai se, kente paucha, 
फिलाडेल्फिया म्यूजियम तक कई लोगों ने परचेज किया कई लोगों ने सेल किया अल्टीमेटली आज वो फिलाडेल्फिया म्यूजियम में है ये ऐसा यूनिक एग्जाम्पल है बिकॉज एशिया के बाहर ऐसी चीजें दिखते नहीं है हम दैट्स वाई ए क्वेश्चन नंबर टू एवरी वन इन पर क्वेश्चन बट इफ यू रेड द पैसेज केयरफुली यू वुड नो दैट आंसर बताइए मुझे What can be inferred about the journey of the mandapam from Madurai to Philadelphia? Of course, Madurai me, wo temple me the, wahan se wo bahut saare logo ke hath me hote be transfer hote hote. It reached the Philadelphia Museum. What can you infer about infer about that? I've already given you the answer. It is going to be. Uh, uh, just a minute. Yes, it is going to be a C. It talks about the journey, how many people owned it. It started from a temple in Madurai. It landed up, ended up, landed into many hands. But ultimately, when it was being after donated from the regal family, it is now present in the. एग्जीबिशन हॉल ऑफ द फिलाडेल्फिया म्यूजियम तो ये जर्नी बहुत आसान नहीं है दिस जर्नी हैज गॉन थ्रू मेनी ओनर्स मेनी ट्रांसफर्स एंड अल्टीमेटली दैट्स हाउ वी सी दिस बींग प्रेजेंट इन द फिलाडेल्फिया म्यूजियम इट हैज हैड मेनी कॉम्प्लेक्स एंड अनसर्टन मल्टीपल ओनर्स दस दैट इज वॉट वी कैन इन फॉर अक्रॉस द स्टोरी पूरी कहानी में यही है फर्स्ट ये ओनर था सेकेंड ये ओनर था एंड दैट्स हाउ इट मूव्स ऑन Question number three, which is the tone of the author towards the mandapam at the Philadelphia Museum of Art? Remember, author ka tone towards the mandapam that's there in the Philadelphia Museum of Art. What will he think about that? Will he be neutral, curious, appreciative, or skeptical? ओके लेट मी गिव यू अ हिंट एक लाइन पढ़ना ठीक है लाइन नंबर वन एंड देन यू कैन टेल मी द आंसर ओके प्रगति से सी प्रगति एक बार री कंफर्म कर लेते हैं द फिलर टेम्पल हॉल और मंडपम एट द फिलाडेल्फिया म्यूजियम इज वैल्यूड For its uniqueness, the only example we know that the tone here is appreciative. He says they're beautiful, they're unique, and they're beautifully carved. Pragati, you've got that correct. It's appreciative. See, question number four. Synonym for the word provenance. Again, I'll take you back to where the word provenance was written. Even if you don't know the exact meaning, sentence will tell you what the answer is. Provenance. ठीक है? Option says source, condition, purpose, effect. Here you go. This is provenance. आनंद आप एम एच सी टी एग्जाम जो थर्सडे को हो रहा है उसके लिए पूछ रहे हो दे से सेपरेट सीरीज हैपनिंग ऑन अ यूट्यूब चैनल लास्ट लैप टू एम एच सी टी उसको देख के प्रिपेयर करो ओ एब्सोल्यूटली प्रगति इट वॉज एब्सोल्यूटली करेक्ट प्रोविनेंस सो द लाइन से दैट I put together essays by experts in an attempt to explore these questions and render a behind-the-scene account of the debates on the provenance and interpretation of the mandapam. Okay, provenance ka meaning. Here you go. Source, 
condition purpose effect what's your answer provenance and interpretation of the mandapam provenance is origin origin kaun sa word ke closest hai source condition purpose effect origin is closest to the word source a is a correct answer next question question number 5 what can be inferred about the significance of the mandapam to the indian american community in the us you know actually it's more of a factual answer if you don't remember this exact line as it may ek line thi jo closure thi paragraph ki that exactly stated ki ye significant hai ya nahi hai for indian american community in the us if you remember that line you can take a leap of faith and tell me the answer if you don't remember i'll take you back to the passage anyway remember is it significant dekho pura passage mein he has appreciated the mandapam right so when he has appreciated the mandapam we can't say that it has no significance incorrect it is primarily of historic and artistic value and does not hold any cultural significance wrong across the passage is appreciative remember we had marked that as the answer d says the mandapam is only significant to indian americans and nobody else again kya se kaha tha these extreme words usually make the option wrong c is our answer that says the mandapam is significant to the growing second and third generation in the in india and in the us as well it's very important it's your cultural heritage so yeah c is your correct answer and on that note mhct if you are sitting for it our analysis is going to happen in two slots on 28th april slot 1 ka analysis 1 pm slot 2 ka analysis 6 pm so remember aapka jo bhi slot hai watch these sessions to know your correct score and uh, last lap to mcct chal raha hai every day don't miss out on the classes bahut sare questions hum kar rahe hain on a youtube channel so that's going to be very very beneficial for you i hope you've subscribed to the channel if you haven't done that yet please do that if you're looking for a course for class 2024 a comprehensive course will cover up every need that you have this is the number of our counselors you can call them to know more about the program that we have make sure you subscribe to our youtube channel like the video follow us on instagram facebook telegram and download our app on google play That's going to be all for today. I shall see you again in the sixteenth session of fifty most common topics of RC. Have a very very good day, everyone. God bless you.